how to create animated menus in Encore by using After Effects. So what I have here set up inside of Adobe Encore is I've got a main, I actually have two menus, but I've got a main um, DVD menu here, which is what I want to um, play the, the animation from. So I'm going to go ahead and the way I have it set up is basically I have a background here created in Photoshop and I have four um, buttons here that are uh, they're basically just pulled from the library here inside of Encore. And what I want to have happen is when I select one of these buttons, I've got an animation that plays out and then it jumps to my, uh, my other menu. So what I want to do first is select the menu and so I've selected here my menu in my project bin inside of Adobe Encore and go to menu and go to create After Effects composition. Now once that occurs it's going to launch After Effects and it's going to pull up your um, your menu item and it's going to drop it down inside of your project bin as a, uh, as a composition that I have here. So what I've done here with the composition is I've just had a very quick, um, very simple animation. I've animated the buttons out and I've set up just a levels effect so I have uh, this washed out effect it just goes to, uh, goes to white there. So when you basically build your animation, so you're building your animation from your, uh, your menu asset from Adobe Encore and that jumps you, that leapfrogs you right into After Effects you set up your animation inside of After Effects that, that, I've, that I've done here, and then you render out that movie. So you would just go to Composition, um, and you would go to Make Movie, and it renders that out as a, um, as a movie file. Then you jump back into Adobe Encore, and you import that movie item, that video file item, as a, uh, just right click, Import as Asset. So I've imported it as an asset that brings it into a, and I've just labeled it Annie Out. Then you go back to your uh, back to your original menu inside of Encore. Select a button, not the menu. Select the button. Go over to your Transition tab over on the right side inside of Adobe Encore, and drag your asset pick whip all the way to the and I've got it labeled Annie Out, so just drag it all the way to your rendered, um, rendered movie file from After Effects. So what happens if we preview this, we'll punch up with the Adobe Photoshop, I'll select this button, and it plays my animation. It'll be a little bit, uh, little bit jerky here on the preview, and then I also have it set up to, uh, to play a, a tutorial movie too. So that's essentially how you can set up um, inside of Encore by utilizing Adobe After Effects.